Hey y'all, so today we're, um, we are actually doing our cabinets. So um, I'll show you the procedure. But first, my mom actually used Norwex cloth with warm water and laundry detergent to just take all the grease off of it or anything that um, the paint will come off of. So I'm taking them the handles off right now. We took quite a few out. I'm just going to take this out so I have room. And so here, um, as you can see, I'm taking the handles out and I'm taking out the screwdriver because it was hard to do it with the And we are also preparing to put the labels with the numbers so we know which door goes back to which place. We removed all the stickers in the corners. Um, and here we put the stickers with the labels again so we know which door goes back to which place. So here, me and my mom did that. And then as you can see, most of the doors are disappearing and I'm thinking they're somewhere. They are in the garage uh, so they can be ready to paint. We did the same thing for the lower level, for the lower level and yeah. So now here, me and my mom were sanding the um, the cabinets, and we used a liquid sanding that we got with from Clean Fresh, I believe it was, and we really liked how it um, took all the gloss off, and it's really nice. Here, my sister is working hard. We were all working hard here, and yeah. Here we did the doors that I took in the garage and again we were sanding them with the liquid and preparing them for paint. And we also used a sand block for the very glossy areas, as you can see here, to get in those corners that was hard to. And, and here we are putting primer, our first coat of primer. And, and this part was scary because we got a bunch of the primer all over the place and it was hard to remove. Here, um, here was difficult to put primer as obviously here I just found myself a comfy spot to prime it and this was fun this was the fun part the sanding part was the most hard because you needed to scrub but this is where this all got fun and he here um, we are putting these plastic covers just to cover anything to pre um, prepare for my mom to spray and here, me and my mom were caulking um, those corners and those edges that were, that had holes and... So here, my mom in that little tube right there is um, primer and she sprayed it. Here, in the meantime, we decided to do a little theater act from my theater and that was super fun here's just us being already tired and we decided to make it fun here uh, my mom is putting the first coat of primer on the doors we really liked the spray and how they all turned out but it took a lot of time and a lot of coats 
You also had to cure between the coats and let it stay a um, couple hours. We use the roller, the brush, and the spray to paint the doors and the cabinets and get into all of the holes and all the spaces that were hard to get in with the brush and with the and with the spray. Here we were at Home Depot and we were shopping for products and we started decided to dance but we also did the walls in the kitchen. So there, if you saw Sarah scrape some letters off the wall. That is... and, and we also cleaned up inside the cabinets. And here my mom is caulking the edges that were, had holes in it. And here the handles came for the doors and we were super excited when they came and to put them in. This were where it all came together and we loved this part the best because finally all came together and it looked so good. And here we are putting the new, the new sheets um, inside the cabinets to protect any scratches. And we also painted the edges with Benjamin Moore Aurora, which we really loved and we used for the whole kitchen. And we, Benjamin Moore Aurora, and it was the red one, the satin, and we loved it so much. So here my mom is painting the island, um, like a green, blue, tealish color, also from Benjamin Moore. because we eat on the table and we don't want any marks from our feet. Here I am um, sanding the chairs and then um, staining it. Me and my mom sanded it and we stained the chairs and this is the finished product. I love how it all turned out and we love our kitchen again. So the experience had been amazing and um, we even pray that one day um, the Lord will open the door for to have a mother-daughter business for painting um, the cabinets. And we just thank the Lord that um, he gave us this opportunity and that he has always been so faithful through everything. And yeah, we love you guys. And um, you can also text my mom for any tips um, on um, kitchen cabinets if you want to paint them and again love you guys and bye